Hi guys, in this video I'll be showing you how to draw the involute of a triangle. But first we have to have our triangle. So in this video I'll be drawing an equilateral triangle. So you can easily draw an equilateral triangle this way. First draw a horizontal line. The horizontal line should be equal to the length of the equilateral triangle, that is the length of sides of the equilateral triangle you want to draw. You can label the line. Next, place your compass on one end of the line. I'm placing my compass on the B end of the line. Then adjust the compass until your pencil is on point A, that is the other end of the line. Then just cut an arc this way. Also place your compass on the other end of the line. So I'm placing my compass this time on the A end of the line. Then cut arc to intersect the previous arc you draw. You can label the point where the arcs intersect. Now just draw a line from the point where the axe intersect to point A and point B. That is the ends of the horizontal line you draw. Now we have our triangle. So it is time to produce the involute. But first we have to draw lines this way. Now place your compass on point A, that is the A end of the line. Then adjust your compass until your pencil is on point B. Then cut an arc this way. The arc should stop at the point where it intersects this line. Next, place your compass on point C. That is the C point of the triangle. Then adjust your compass until this point, until your pencil is on this point. That is where the previous arc stop. Then produce another arc. This arc also should stop at this point, that is where it intersects this line. Next is point B. Remember that your pencil should be on the point where the previous arc stopped. Now we have our involute, but should in case you are asked to draw normal and tangent to the involute, this is how you do it. First, draw the normal from a point. That is, it is easier to draw it from point B. So, so this is the normal line. To draw the tangent, the tangent should be perpendicular to your normal line. So you can easily use a protractor to draw the tangent. So that is it. We have our involute, our normal and our tangent. So we can just label the drawing.
If you have any question on engineering and technical drawing in general, you can message me on WhatsApp. The number displayed on the screen is my WhatsApp number. Also, share this video with your colleague.